Hi and welcome, I'm Kristen Fulci, the brand strategist, website designer, and commercial photographer for creative businesses. Today I'm going to show you how to add your Flowdesk ribbon form to your Squarespace website. So the very first thing you're gonna to wanna to make sure you do is log into Flowdesk and log into your Squarespace site. Today we will be using my amazing client, Cindy Stack's website. She is a coach. She is so amazing. We're going to be launching her site in a couple of weeks. Um, and I'm going to just kind of add in the form right under here in the footer. I'm assuming that's where you're going to want to add yours into, but you can follow the same steps and add it anywhere on your homepage. So the first thing you're going to want to do is create that form in Flowdesk. Once you're done designing everything the way that you want, you'll be prompted to go all through the steps and it will take you to this little embed page and there's going to be two pieces of code that you're going to need to put onto your Squarespace site. So the very first one right here we're going to go ahead and add to the page itself. So we're going to put copy code. We're going to add it into the header section. So we're going to come over here to Cindy Stack and because we want to have this on the home page and we're going to want to have it on every page we're going to repeat the same thing. So we're gonna to go to pages and we're gonna add it into the home. So I'm only gonna do it in the home page just um, for the sake of time of the video, but you're gonna to wanna to go ahead and repeat the steps on your about page, on your services page, because we wanna make sure that this works no matter where your visitor goes on your website. So you're gonna go ahead and click hover over this and then the little gear will, will appear. We're gonna click that gear. And then over here, we're gonna go all the way down here to advanced. And that's where we're gonna go ahead and paste that code that we just copied. So command V, we got it all in there, so easy. And then we're gonna click save. And so that's just letting it know, hey, that's where we're gonna reference that little piece of code that we're gonna now put on your actual homepage in your footer. So we're gonna go grab this second piece of code. So hop back over to Flowdesk, hit copy code, get that copy to our clipboard come back into Squarespace, and this is where we're gonna actually go in and edit the footer content. So anywhere that you want the form on your website, you're gonna hover over it and you're gonna click edit. You can do the same thing if you want it up here on your site, you can hover over, click edit, works the same way. I'm gonna go ahead and add it right underneath her existing newsletter block. So we're gonna hit edit. We're gonna hover over here, get this little line, let that come up, and we're gonna click code. We're gonna scroll down just a bit, it's right here, it looks like this. You're gonna click code. And then we're gonna erase this hello world. So delete. And then we're gonna put command V and get that little bit of code put in there and click apply. Then we're gonna go ahead and save it. It is not showing it to you here on the back end. You're gonna to wanna to go to the front page of your website after you click save here, after you put in that header um, code over there, click save. And then we're gonna to wanna to go to your actual website. I'm gonna go ahead and hit refresh. And there we go, it appears here on the footer of your Squarespace website. If you still do not have a paid plan for Flowdesk, you can go ahead and sign up with 50% off using code Kristen Fulci. Helps to save you a little bit of money in your business and brings down that monthly rate to $19 a month. If you found this video helpful, go ahead and hit the like button and comment below and I will see you next time.